guys, check out the next level games for all your TCG needs. Link is down below in the description of the video. Thanks, guys. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Team Fish Knuckles YouTube channel. Today is another day of testing for NIC, and today we're playing Quagsar Naganado. Now, this is another hype deck that people are kind of building up a little bit because, you know, all the fire is everywhere. So, uh, I mean, you got some cute stuff in here, but I, I mean, we've, we've played the deck before. I don't think it was with Naganado. I think it was just like Quagsire or something else. But uh, it's a pretty simple deck. You have Quagsire with the uh, Washout. That's awesome. You like Dirty Turn. You may move a Water G from one of your bench Pokemon to your active Pokemon. And it has a Hydro Pump 60 and does 20 more damage for each Water G attached to this Pokemon. So, and uh, that's pretty much the strategy. You have Naganado for that charge up. Uh, you have Onyx in there for the Pika Raw matchup. You have the Oranguru to help draw and instruct. Ditto can involve the Quagsire and Naganado. Magikarp Wailord is a beast. And it could just like Towering Splash to like take a bunch of knockouts and weak a bunch of your opponent's Pokemon if need be. Also, you can just like Super Splash for 180 uh, Constellation or something like that. Maybe Ace Roll. But Towering Splash GX is definitely really good. If you have eight Water Gs, you can pull that 100 damage to each of your opponent's bench Pokemon and technically like maybe finish the game. Volcanian's good. It's got that Sauna Blast, which I do like a lot. 120 sniped Pokemon. Uh, then it has that Jet Geyser discard of Water GPD. You your opponent switches are active with one of their bench, so it could disrupt them a little bit, which is pretty cool. Uh, for Acrobikes, we want to draw cards fast so we can get Water G's in discard pile. For Aqua Patches, of course, we get Water G's to our Quagsires. Volcanian, uh, not so much our Magic Card. If we put down Magic Card from Waylord, he better be winning the game. Uh, Field Blower to help get rid of tools. Um, which is really good. There's a bunch of wishful batons, and it could uh, help out maybe some stadiums. I don't think there's really anything you have to worry about too much. Uh, four nests and four ultra ball. Find your Pokemon ASAP. Two stretchers because you do have uh, weak HP Pokemon 120. They're going to be attacking your Naganados and Whoopers out of every single second they can. Uh, two Verdian Force. Find your energies. Four Cynthia Ford Lily. And one Guzma. I think that's fine with one Guzma. Having the Son Jet Geysers, I was going to say Sonic Blast. This, the Jet Geysers is just really good to have. I had to break Pokemon off the bench and help you get knockouts. And then, like I said, you can just Tower and Splash to pick up your knockouts instead of Guzma for eight end game. And a lot of us I see play one Guzma. Uh, three, Wish for Time, and we were playing 10 Water G because it seemed like the staple. So it's a pretty staple deck that I've seen a lot of people play. So we're going to save this as Quagsire. I think I saw we had an older list. It was nothing built like this. So I'm fine with making, making this the new Quagsire deck. And to see what's gonna, yeah, I know, I, I just, I just told the, the viewers, guys, I just told the viewers, you know, there is a Quagsire deck already saved. You don't have to call me out like that. Um, but yeah, day two, I think Quagsire is a good place to go because we really haven't seen on the channel. Uh, Thursday and Friday are gonna be a little bit different. They're gonna be decks we have seen that I haven't visited in a long time. Um, but I'm excited. Um, we've recovered a lot of the new set. We haven't really gone back in time. And uh, that's what the last two, uh, th that's what Thursday and Friday are going to be. Uh, Wednesday, I'm not sure what's going to be just yet, uh, but we'll figure it out, right? Uh, so playing against Lightning, and like I said, we have the Onyx in here. I mean, Quagsire still can just do like a, a hefty amount to like Lightning decks. Um, there's also a Fighting Quagsire. If you do want to put that in your deck, um, that could help you out a lot as well. Uh, but right now, we're just going to start with Wooper, start with Poipul. We only play two Poipul, and then Oran Guru. So it's already a pretty good start. I mean, we could attach a Water G and Ram. We can uh, Radiant Forest Water and then go crazy um, just to put a Water G in our discard pile. So we definitely see a Lightning deck. <laughs> uh, we took Grass. So just a heads up if you didn't know that. Yeah, we'll draw for Mulligan. There's a Lily. So we can go Radiant Forest Water. Attach, fail the Verdi Force, and Lily for a bunch of new cards. That's not a bad thing either. So we see a Nest Ball. Okay. Let's see here. Also, Friday, we might not even cover a deck. We might just like say, like, oh, the, the stream is happening today. So go watch NIC. So that might be what happening. Uh, we might just see one more game, and then Friday, we just give a shout out to the stream and just let you know people watch the stream. And I think that's what we really need to focus on people watching the stream this weekend. Wow. Okay. Well, I guess we'll go here and poison the Jirachi. It's not a bad thing. Um, it's just a little annoying for sure. Right? Mm. I want to save my Orange Guru. Yeah, I think it's fine. It's fine. There's a Nest Ball. Okay. I, I think this is more of like the Jirachi base deck, right? Yeah, I think it's what this is. I said Jirachi base deck, and I meant Zapdos. As soon as I was taking a drink, I was like, oh, I didn't mean water-based. I mean, drive-based. I mean, 
Never mind. I'm, okay, so it's not Zapdos based, but you see Pikachu's are on 240 HP. Onyx can just like clean that thing up. Uh, and it takes three price cards. So, that's the big thing there. Alright, so Synthia for New Hand of Six. Okay. Let's see what else they find. So, we need to get our Onyx out ASAP. We need, we just need to get a bunch of energies on the field. Uh, find a, multiple whoopers, multiple point pools. There's a Zapdos. I thought it was going to be multiple Zapdos. It must be like the hybrid kind of Pika Rum thingy bobber that we've seen before. So, uh, let's see. Ultra Ball. Just kind of Zapdos. There's a Zero Ore to give that free retreat. Uh, okay. Zero Ore coming down. And uh, just pass the dark turn. Okay. So, oh my goodness. So, we go here for another whooper. Unfortunately, Onyx is priced. <laughs> One a downer. Okay. So, here, here. Lily, I guess I got an Orin Grood. Um, destruct a little bit more. Let's go here to find another Poipool. Uh, Acrobike? Ooh, it's a tough decision. I think I'm gonna go Wish for Baton. Now we can save the Wooper if need be. Uh, do we put the Wishful on the Wooper or not? Or do we, I, I think, yeah, it's not a bad idea. I've done far worse before. Okay, so like I said, the only unfortunate thing is our Onyx is price, but maybe Quagsire can like have a billion energy and like one shot this Picarum. That's very unlikely, but I mean, it, it, uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty, forty, fifty, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three. We would need uh, three, six, nine. We need nine energy attached to Quagsire, which I mean, it uh, da, 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 probably can't happen next turn, but you know. We can at least do a significant amount of damage to it and then not drop the, um, yeah, I think that might be a good way to do it. So we're going to see him probably go Guzma the Whooper. No, he can't attack right now. So he's got a Volkner. Um, so that's okay. The worst thing is he does, he knocks out my Poipool. Okay, there's a Jirachi coming up. Okay, another Stellar Wish. I mean, he... He lay laid for Volkner, so he he should. Well, he doesn't have if he doesn't have any lightning energy in discard pile, he actually can't attack this turn. So there is the lightning, okay. But does he have a way to discard a light? So you can Volkner. Yeah, I don't think he can attack this turn. Unless he's got Thunder Mountain Hand. I'm so smart at Pokemon. <laughs> oh, I just love myself sometimes. Okay, so <clears throat> anyways, okay, so how do we want to deal with this hand next turn? So field blower and lightning. So he's gonna go quick on the field blower to get rid of the wish baton. Uh, not a bad thing. Oh, actually, he's not gonna go for a field blower right now. He's gonna hold off on it. Hmm. Okay. Is the lightning to the active? So he's going to try to go for a double knockout on the both Quagsires. That's what I imagine is going to happen. So we go one Quagsire. We can go Ultra Ball. Discard the Magikarp from Whaler GX. And the Lily. To find another Whooper. Wow. So we got to go Ditto. Or do we go Naganadal, just try to get attack off this turn? But like I said, he's going to double knock us out this turn. Hmm, that's not good. <sighs> How do we want to do this? I mean, we've got the charge up and everything. So if we go Cynthia and we hit a Water J, we have an attack this turn. Okay, we need to summon another Wooper. And we got it. Okay, so we'll go here. Well, we don't have an attack off yet. We'll go for Ditto. We'll go Acrobike. For the water. There we go. We'll go Charge Up. Water Energy. The only problem is we can't attack again next turn. Huh. Yeah, we can't attack again next turn. That's unfortunate. 
Because we don't have double Naganadal. Oh, no, Joshua. You are in trouble. Cause you have no okay, so this is the... Yeah, this is bad. This is real bad. Hmm. We are in trouble because we can't attack again next turn. Huh. So we, we got the turn to attack. The problem is we can't attack again next turn. Huh. Okay, so what we can do is put down Quagsire, attach a water to Oranguru, turn, and then, like, I think that might be the only way really to do this. Is like, um. <clears throat> Yeah, I think that's what we need to do, is we kind of just go for a Psychic, and then he knocks out the Oranguru, and then we got to find another way to get a Naganito down. Like, that's really the only way. I should have stretched it for the other Poipo. I don't know why I didn't do that. I should have just, that's definitely what I should have done last turn, and I didn't. We see, we see the tackle, GX taking the double knockout, getting the Quagsire, get, getting the Ditto, actually. I guess it's essentially the same thing I'm not gonna the whooper, right? Yeah. I mean I guess it technically is. Uh, I mean, so we're not out of it just yet. Um Because we have aqua patches. So go here, here, here. We go charge up once. <laughs> okay. And struck for one. Let me find another Pokemon. The problem is, is our other Pokemon of prize. <gasps> we got it though. We got the Volcanion. We got the Aqua Patch. Got the Water G. We got the Washout. One to here. One to here. Six, seven, eight, nineteen, eleven, twelve. I was a little nervous, but we did it. Now we're taking three prize cards. But can he re-knock us out? I mean, always, right? There's a Naganadal. There is a Field Blower. And a Blooper. Alrighty, so that's what we kind of want to see. I mean, once again, we can kind of attack with Volcani in this turn. Uh, so what can happen? Well, he really... I mean, man, we did find the Onyx either. I mean, Onyx definitely doesn't get a knockout right now, unfortunately. Um, but he needs another field blower. If not, we can move those energies to Volcanion and then swing with like a sauna blast. So let loose the four. Hmm, that's unfortunate. Okay. So we get four no cards. Okay, so it's not bad, right? We have the Nest Ball to find another Whooper. Um, Acrobike, hopefully draw out of it. And then we'll go from there. Uh, we can just load a bunch of energies in the field. And then, like I said, maybe we can just like try to one-shot this thing. And it, it, you know, it's definitely going to be difficult. But we will try to go our best way. I mean, and the worst thing is, like, we take a knock on the Drachi. Then we hit the Onyx. And then we can take a knock on the Falling Turn or something like that. So, I mean, he can't attack us now. Um, there's no way. Because he doesn't have space for um, Tapu Koko. So, that's good. <laughs> So yeah, we're gonna okay. There's a Mew. Ooh, huh, that's actually a really good card because um, the card would win us the game right now. <laughs> it would. If we get Tower and Splash, knock out three Pokemon like one, two, three. That's cute. Okay, so we'll go. Um, let's see. We'll Nest Ball first. Find the Whooper. Okay. Leia, let's go for Acrobike. Not what I want to see. You know what? It's actually not that bad. We can go Viridian Force. We can go Viridian Force. Okay. Ultra Ball. One and two. For nothing. Because we can't evolve anything. And then we instruct for three. And let's see what we find here. Well then, <laughs> okay. Well, do this for this. Define this. We'll go one aqua patch to the whooper. Those aqua patch to the volcanian. Um, that way we can attack with the next turn. But once again, if we don't attack right now, he really can't do too much. 
right? If we attack, he can't attack us. And I, I know that's a weird way of saying it. And it's true because if we attack him right now, the most he can do is hatch a lightning to Pikachu Zekrom and that's it. Or do we take a knockout and hope we just like knock out something else? Hmm. We could jet guys and see what he brings up. I'm actually just going to pass. I, I know that's weird, but I'm just going to pass right now. I'm fine with that play. Yeah, I'm gonna wait a second because he can't. He can't attack us. That's the thing. Um, we can load more energies in the field. Okay, we can go for another Quax or another Oranguru, and then maybe we can go for a Guzma. I know there's a Guzma in the deck. I well, I don't know if it's in the deck. We we play a Guzma. Sorry, that's my correct answer. Um, we got rid of Thunder Mountain, so he can't attack with this guy anymore. You only play one of these. There's a Lily. That's I'm gonna get what one card? Okay. Electro power. Electro power. Just burning cards right now. I mean, we get enough energies for Magic Carpet Whaler. That's a way we can do it as well. I mean, he can't attack right now, unless I'm missing something. Why would you promote this guy? Unless I am missing something. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I mean, the, oh, the custom catchers. To bring up the Volcanion, okay. I mean, it's, I mean, what, we're gonna smack him in the face for 100 and then you 20 to everybody? Oh, I don't care, okay. Oh my goodness. Hmm. Charge up. More water energy. Um. We can stretcher three back in deck. Or, I mean, we have a lot of different options here. Hmm, I haven't attached yet. So we can attach here. We can hit for a mass amount of damage with a Quaxar. Can we win? One, two, three, four, five, six. No. So a stretcher. I'm gonna put. Man, this is a tough. Set. I'm gonna put one. Two, we play two of these, right? Yeah, I'm gonna grab another Quagsire. That's what I'm doing right now. I'm gonna grab a Quagsire. We'll put down the Quagsire, and then I'm gonna struck for three. Yeah, I think this is the best way to go about it. Okay, so we can, we have a water, yeah, oh, so we can go ready force the water. Oh, it's so a Guzma's price as well. Wow, okay. <laughs> the more you know. Fieldblower away, choice band, choice band, or skateboard. And then, well, Santa your hand of six, okay. So we got the aqua patch to here. Wishful baton. Wash out a water energy from here to here. Press done. Yeah. And then yeah, we'll just sauna blast. Seems good. Seems good to me. And then we can one-shot this guy next turn with all the energies on the field. I think this is the right way. I think we win this game. Uh, yeah, sure. I mean, so we pretty much destroyed Pikaram even though we didn't even have Onyx. Like, that's what I've learned. This deck is a lot more stronger than I thought. And that is what I'm learning right now. I mean, because what can you do? All right? You can take a prize card, go down to Quagsire, just blows him up. Um, yeah. It's not look. I mean, so you don't even need a fighting Quagsire to beat this deck. I mean, my opponent went probably the wrong way about it, and he went like heavy Pika Rom. Um, so yeah, just our turn. Okay, so we can just like what water retreat, charge up, water. We can go Aqua Patch. I mean, we've got the game. We've got the game. And then we'll move all the energies to the active. 
So wash out. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, we're gonna. Oh, we got. We actually got the full amount to just one shot it if we want to. Yep, there we go. All right. So I think, like I said, I think my opponent went the wrong way of doing this. I think he should have went the. I mean, we probably have two whoopers, the Guzma and the Onyx, and still were able to take down the GX deck. Oh my goodness. Um, but like I said, I think my opponent went around the wrong way and went like heavy Picarom when he definitely should have just went like, um, what is it? Definitely should have just went, uh, Zapdos maybe and stuff like that. I think that would have been, maybe it was a little bit more of a problem, but maybe it's a better match than I thought. I mean, the, the, Zapdos, the Zapdos is like definitely like a hundred percent better. Like I think it is. Okay, so I'm in game two. That was a long game one, but I mean, hey, it went a lot better than yesterday. I'm already having more fun playing this than playing with Cephalon. <laughs> That's all you gotta know. Okay, so it's a um, spread deck. Okay, so... Okay, that's great. <laughs> okay, DC is active. I mean, we can, like, Jet Geyser, bring up something off the bench to the active, and that could be really good. I'm not thinking it's probably some of the... Oh, here's some of the Drachi, actually. It seems like a lot. Uh, yeah, seems good. Spill Tag. Okay. Mm, okay, no. Let's see what else we got. Uh, the only problem is, like, Volcanion doesn't one-shot a coughing, just to let you know that, if you didn't know how math works. Another copy in the field. Okay. Man, what if Jet Geyser would let you bring whatever Pokemon you want to the active? That would be broken. Uh, so, Sacrobite. Uh, it's for Cynthia. Okay. That's okay. Discarded. Acrobike. Whoa. Guess it really doesn't matter how that one went, does it? Not here? Hmm. Okay. We'll go water to the active. Ultra Ball. You know what I should have did? I should have kept the Stretcher, and then I could have Ultra Balled the two Naganados away, and then Stretcher back them. Oh well. We'll go Poipool. Put down Poipool, and then we'll Lily for six. We need to try to borrow a Pokemon ASAP in this matchup, so we'll do this for another Wooper. Okay. Mm, I know myself breathing hell for good reasons, so oh please take me. Na, 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 na. Oh, uh, yeah, we'll go Poi Poi. Okay. Aqua Patch. Pass. Okay. So on to our opponent's turn. I mean, we got the Naganito Quagsire Cynthia. Okay, there's a detention gas coming down. I was kind of debating put the Poipo down or not because I know the stretchers in the deck or in the discard pile. Uh, there's one in the deck, um, and then the other Naganitos in the prize or in the discard pile already. So definitely was like questioning it because it's gonna get hit for sure. So double spell tag, splatter and sludge. Okay. Everybody taking their damage on our turn. Um, so we can swing this turn. So we'll go here, here, here. Cynthia for new hand of six. All right. Ooh, hand is not that good, Josh. Okay, so we'll go ready force water for water. Charge up. We have 110. Hmm. Uh, this washout here. Done. Definitely misplay because that thing's going to get knocked out now. Mm, so I got to move it here. I could Jet Geyser, and that would actually save us. Good jet geyser. Let's see who he sends up. Now we're gonna take a knockout. Don't get me wrong. We're not. It doesn't. Oh no, yeah. It doesn't save our whoopers because we could take a knockout 
And, well, it did, yeah, we're taking a knockout no matter what. So that's good. We're taking a knockout. That's a good thing. But he can take a double knockout coming to our turn. Because, well, this has 7 HP. That's just too... Uh, either way, it's problematic. Why well, does got to show... <laughs> Thanks. Thanks for reminding me. I know. I know his muse in the field. I got that. All right, so Nass Ball. That's a bad card. Okay. Na, 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 na. Oh, na, 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 na. So, yeah, this is the on... Oh, it has 20. Ah... So we're still kicking. Okay. That's good. Okay. Well, we'll just bump that immediately. Cynthia. Man, can I one-shot this wheezing this turn? That is my question of the day. <clears throat> okay. Another net. Another wheezing. Okay. I mean, we could bring up another Pokemon and just, like, take a knockout this turn as well. So that's not a bad thing. The problem is we got to eventually deal with this wheezing, right? Splatter and sludge. Okay, we're still alive. We're still kicking. Not for long, though. Not for long. Okay, so, I mean, we get to take a knockout this turn. Um, that's for sure. What, Josh? How? Well, we, uh... Got plenty of ways here. Yep. Man, I wish I could get these spell tags off, because that's going to be a pain right now. Um, okay, so we can go this on here, Touch of Water, Wish Watton, Nest Ball, Fail It, <coughs> Nest Ball for Oranguru, and then we have to hope Oranguru hits the Instruct of our life. Okay, that's a pretty good Instruct there. If this Lily can hit me a stretcher, the Lily can hit me a stretcher. Uh, dang it. Uh, we'll go Wish of a Baton. See, I'm just going to retreat into this guy and just take a knockout. Yeah, that's all we can really do. Press done. Uh, turning point. Okay. Let's go down to four. Yeah, I know this spell tag is put four damage counters. Um, how's he gonna put him? I don't know. Probably two on this guy because then the splatter surge knocks us out. Uh, well, just one actually. No, he needs two. Yeah. And then this the splatter surge will swing, uh, go into his favor. Um, where does he put the other ten? I don't know. That's the real question. I have no idea how that's gonna work. Okay. That sounds good. Go down to four price cards. Onyx. Not a good card. <laughs> <clears throat> okay. Huh. So he's about to take a knockout on this guy, this guy, this turn. Goes down to four. Okay. Huh. We do get the water juice since he... So what he should have did... I guess it doesn't really matter. It can't work in that way anyway. Okay. So we'll, we'll keep the water juice. So that's good at least. Um, so we can move the water juice to Quagsire. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yeah, let me take a knockout. If we can find the Wish of Baton, I'd be so happy. And not a Wish of Baton, a uh, Field Blower. I'd be so happy right now. So Let Loose. Okay, so the Let Loose is actually not bad here because our hand is like actually terrible. Um, so yeah. Okay, there's an Aqua Patch and Ultra Ball. We can at least thin our deck down a lot. Oh, he's going to take, like, multiple prize cards because this guy's going to get knocked out. Well, no, he doesn't have a wheezing, so that's good. Okay, so we need to find a way to get rid of the spell tag. That is the truth. It's your boy Guzma. That's a terrible card to get right now. Terrible. Okay, yeah, whatever. Just Ultra Ball... Okay, we need to find the stretcher. And even then, our hand, our deck is... We have no more supporter cards in our deck. Holy cow. Okay. Let's instruct for two. 
Uh, okay. We go. Did was my field blower in there? I have no idea. Okay, so now we can attack this turn. So that and we got the oh, and we got the field blower. Oh, so good. One and two. Yep. Stretcher, we'll put three into our deck. Putting Naganadal. Oh, I guess we just put Naganadal. Oh, we should just put Naganadal in our hand. Uh, whoops. Okay. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Woo, we barely did it. So wash out. One, two. Hydro Pump. There we go. Going to three. Going to three prize cards. How many do we have like other supporter cards in our deck that we can play? I mean, we have another Cynthia that's in our prize cards. Jirachi coming up. Okay, so into our opponent's turn. Let's see. I mean, he can attack with um, uh, maybe a Weezing this turn, right? Like Ditto, Weezing, and then uh, we're on a time clock for sure. Because this guy gets knocked out. <laughs> Yep, there's a lava charm being discarded for wheezing. Okay, okie dokie. At least we got rid of the spell tag. That was a great. That was a great um, lily. I cannot be. That was pretty good, especially being one of our last ones. So we gotta hit. I should have just kept the the. I should have just put Naga Needle in my hand. Like that definitely seems like a better play. I don't know why I just didn't do that. But right now, I mean, he's going to put this at 40. This guy's going to take another 10. This dude is going to take 10. Stella Wishing. Wish Upon a Star. Don't know where you are. The terrible thing is he could hit Guzma to Splattering Sludge. Knock out that guy. No! <laughs> no, he's going to take a double knockout. No! Oh, okay. Well, he's going to send that guy up. Okay. That's uh, pretty terrible still. Okay. Well, that's bad. Hey, Coco coming down. Okay. All right. Not gonna know. Uber is not what I wanted to say. Okay, we gotta go here. We gotta go here. We gotta go here. We gotta instruct for two. lost yet don't get me wrong we are really close though huh I mean I guess we do have to at least attack right at least we attack for 80 that's the play right now and then next turn we swing I know the tension gas coming off Shrine coming up. I know. I knew what I was doing to put down the Magic Upway Alert. I knew what I was doing. We were on a time clock regardless. He needs another energy. He just wins. Well, um, he doesn't win-win, but it's looking pretty good in his favor. Huh. So many damage Pokemon. It's your boy Guzma bringing up Quagsire. Okay, why this Quagsire? I don't know. Uh, cause he's gonna find an energy and knock out the the orange guru. An escape rope. Okay, that's not what he wants to see. Does he not have an energy? You gotta think he has to have the energy, right? Yep. 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 Okay, that's game. Yep. <laughs> uh, like I said, it's pretty much game from there. Like, it's such a bad deck. But at least game one, we showed how good Quagsire was, right? Uh, this one is uh, definitely a failure. Thanks. I don't even know what I'm doing right now. Okay, well, I'm done Tuesday. Okay, so we can see how Quagsire does do good. Uh, Weezing is definitely a still a really good deck. We've covered it before. We're not going to cover it again for NIC, but still... 
Really good deck. I think this is like fine. It's it's not the best. It's like definitely tier two ish. But people are gonna play this for NIC, thinking it's gonna be Reshram Charizard. Just my advice: don't play the last two decks. Like if you're gonna play Fire, play Reshram or, or play Reshram Charizard. If you're gonna play a Water deck, just you're you're not gonna beat the Reshram Charizard. So they're I mean you might be able to beat them, but they have like Eevee Snorlax now and Arcanine and stuff like that. So it's definitely still a shaky matchup. So my advice: don't play this. Just play a better deck. Uh, but yeah. Thursday, we'll see. I'm trying to get. I'm, I'll decide if I'm doing Thursday and Friday or just Thursday. Uh, There's pretty much one deck I want to cover, maybe two, but we'll wait and see. But guys, hold on. Why do I have 59 cards in my deck all of a sudden? What happened? Like, what happened? I have 59 cards now. I don't know. What I, What happened? I lost a card. Was I playing illegally the whole time with an illegal deck? And Pokemon didn't stop me? What card am I missing now? I have no idea. Uh, no, I don't want to discard him. No, what? Yeah, I want to discard him. What? What? What card was I missing? I have no idea. But guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. All right, I see you tomorrow for Wednesday. Bye.